In this tutorial video, you will learn how to add links to the top bar of your SharePoint site. Depending on how your SharePoint site is set up, there are two ways of adding quick links to the top bar. First, let's click on the settings gear in the top right corner of our SharePoint site. Next, let's scroll down to our site settings. Under the look and feel section, click on the top link bar. Here you will see that home is the only navigation link that has been created for the top link bar so far. To create a new link, first open up a new tab or tabs in your browser to where you want the link or links to navigate to. For the purpose of this video, I have opened up my tabs already. The new link can either navigate to an existing location on your SharePoint site or an external website. For this example, I'm going to open up two tabs so that we can add links for both the corporate intranet homepage as well as a link to our document library, which I have simply named Documents. Once we have our tabs open, we can go back to our tab that has the site settings open and click New Navigation Link. Here we can copy and paste the first URL for our first link. So I will first copy the corporate intranet URL into the web address bar. So let's copy. and paste it into our web address bar. Next I will type UHN Corporate Internet as the description. This will be the title of the link. Now let's click OK to save our changes. You can see that UHN Corporate Internet has been added next to our home link. Let's repeat those steps to add a link to our document library. Click New Navigation Link. Go to your tab where your document library is open and copy your URL and let's paste it back into our web address bar. Let's title this link Documents. Click OK to save those changes. You will now see that Documents has been added to your top link bar. Now we can test both links to make sure they're properly linked. So let's click on UHN Corporate Internet and I've been navigated to the corporate internet page so let's go back and lastly let's test our documents and I'm in my document library both of my links are now functioning I'm also able to change the order of these links by simply clicking change order for example if I wanted documents to be next to my home link I simply have to change the link order with these numbers on the left hand side. So let's change the position of UHN Corporate Intranet to number 3 and it automatically makes documents number 2 in the link order list. Let's click OK to save those changes and you will see it goes Home Documents UHN Corporate Intranet which is the order I want. Another way of adding links is if you are the owner of your SharePoint site. You may see Edit Links next to your top link bar. Simply click Edit Links, next click Add a Link. Here you can copy and paste the URL, so let's say we wanted to add a link to our calendar. Let's copy and paste the address. The text to display is simply the title of your link, so let's call it Calendar, and click OK. And let's say we wanted to move the calendar right next to our home page. We simply need to click and drag it over until you see the word calendar. Let go. And then we click save. All right, let's test that link now. And it brings us to our calendar. Thank you for watching this tutorial video. For more videos like these, please go to the Corporate Internet's YouTube channel.